everyone welcome back to my channel my name is up in case you guys are new here today's video is a shop my stash video for the month of january i have not done a video like this since last april you guys um part of it is because of the pandemic i feel like i really just have not been wearing that much makeup i'm sure some of you guys can relate I only wear makeup when I'm filming for you guys or when I'm going to someone's house but if I'm going to the store and stuff like I definitely only do my eyes so I kind of organized this this morning um, these are some of the items that I have been using in the past couple of days and I do want to change it up a little bit the shadow that you see here is from iHeart Revolution line or iHeart Chocolate from Revolution Beauty and um, this is like the dupe for Too Faced and I have been using this one but I want to switch it up I did start a new job so I am looking for a palette which is still in the neutral family so we're gonna go through my collection switch this section up a little bit and yeah let's see what we can find in my stash okay guys I just wanted to show you guys what's here so basically the only setting spray that I have been using is this one from a brand called Pure Lessons and it's just a regular aloe and green tea makeup mist and I'm gonna continue to keep using that because I'm not really going out that much and I feel like that would be a good thing to just keep using it so I can use it up and then show it in my empties videos the perfumes I am not gonna change because honestly I want to use up most of these or body sprays whatever you want to call them I want to you know use up some of these so I'm probably not gonna change that for this month okay guys so I think I'm going to put my wispies back in here because I'm not really going to be wearing false eyelashes anytime soon and I do want to change up my foundation and uh, my primer so let's see what we have here so I think I don't have that many left primers in my collection I do want to use this one this is by revolution it's their hydrate um, prime and primer apparently <laughs> anyways I do want to use this one because I feel like I need to switch out the one that I'm using and then for foundation the only one I think because this is a lighter shade over here this one is from Maybelline it's their dream radiant liquid foundation and I think I will enjoy that. I really am not wearing too much face makeup, um, but I do want to put back my blush and the highlighter that I was using. And then for blushes, I just put my other blushes back and my highlighter back as well. So I think I'm gonna go with the e.l.f. blush palette. I've had this one for a while. I think I want to use this one. Yeah, I do want to use that one, um, especially because some of the colors are darker and during winter time, I can always use those. And I have not used my Wet n Wild highlighter in a really long time. And I absolutely love this color. So I think for highlighter, that's what I'm going to use this time around. I think I'm going to put the Sheer Tint Finishing Powder back because... I have another one from e.l.f. which I do want to use which is actually already in my container over here and this, this is the e.l.f. Uh, translucent powder. I'm going to use that as an under eye setting powder and I don't think I want anything else from this section. Okay guys, I just wanted to let you know that I'm not going to change my concealers. These are the only two concealers that I own in my collection. This one, I think I will be using this one for the days when I am not wearing a full face of makeup because this one matches my skin tone more than this shade. So I just wear it under my eyes and since I have, you know, mask on the whole time, like no one's really gonna see much of my face anyway so that's what i use that one for and this one is for the days when i really want to contour and highlight 
I do want to change up my lipsticks, probably not my mascara. Um, yeah, I think I'm still going to use the same old, same old. The other stuff I'm probably not going to change. The lip liners, um, these are all of my, well most of them are my neutral lip liners over here. And these are my neutral lipsticks, but I do want to change this. So let's see what we can find. Okay guys, so this is what the lipstick section currently looks like. This is supposed to be all of my neutral lipsticks, but it looks like I have some not neutral colors in here. So I'm going to take those out real quick. I think that was all of them. Now it's all of them. But um, yeah, I want to put those away. And I really have not been wearing regular lipsticks too much. I prefer to wear, um, you know, liquid lipstick, especially with the masks. But if I'm staying home, I do want to utilize more of my regular lipsticks. So this one is from Revlon. It's their Color Burst Matte Lip Balms. I used to love this. And I have not used this one in a really long time. So I think I'm going to pick this one. And maybe another like brownish lip shade. I really like brown nude. Let's pick a liquid lipstick. Can you tell I'm having a hard time deciding? Yeah. Maybe this one. I don't think I've used this shape here. Okay, so this is from Jordana. It's in the shade Tiramisu, and it's their liquid lipstick. So I think two will be enough, two different um, shades. They're definitely different colors, even if you can't really tell on camera. They definitely are. Maybe you can see now, but yeah, they definitely are. One is a little bit more on the brown side. The other one is more on the pink side. And I'm just going to put the ones that I had been using the past couple of days back where they belong. And yeah, that is it for lipstick. Okay, moving on to the second drawer. This one has my contour and some of my larger blush palettes. I think because e.l.f. is right here. And I have already panned this and I want to pan this one a little bit more. Excuse this. I don't know what it is. I'm going to have to like maybe wipe it or something. But um, I think I'm going to go with e.l.f. again. I feel like I have not been wearing some of the e.l.f. palettes. And what's in here? This is body care. So we don't care about that. I'm going to try to put this back where it belongs. I think, think it was in here. And... Like I said, I definitely just want to focus more on neutrals this month. So we'll see what we can find here. Hmm. Does this have neutrals? Let me just double check. Yeah, it does have neutrals. It has a good mix of different um, neutral shades. It does have like, you know, more brighter orange stuff, but... I think I'm going to go with this one. I haven't used this in a while and I really do enjoy this brand from Amazon that I got and this is Prism Makeup. So I think I'm going to be adding that to the stash. I think I would want another palette because this has shopped my stash for, you know, in the entire month. So I think I want to use the one from Makeup Revolution. I know it looks busted. And this is the Velvet Rose Reloaded Velvet Rose Palette. And I absolutely love this one. And I have not used this one in a really long time. So I think I'm going to go with this one. And then going down to nail polish. I have two buckets here. I want to pick up four nail polishes for this month. I'm so glad that I can do my um, nails again. So as usual, I am going to have the gel coat with me. But now I need to have two like winterish colors. Hmm, this is always a struggle for me. Did I paint my nails red anytime? I don't think I painted my nails red anytime recently. So I think I'm going to paint them red. 
Let's see. I think I painted them magenta. I don't think I've painted them like this purple color, so I'm gonna do that. And what else do we have here? Maybe I wanna go with gold this time too. So I want four because there's four weeks in January or weeks left for me anyways. And maybe another sparkly one. Oh, I see another one here. This is like a nude sparkly one and I think I really would like that. So four nail polishes and I think I covered all the categories in this video. So I think that was it and I'll show you guys a summary. Okay guys, so I'm so pumped to use these products. Uh, so these are again the eyeshadow palettes. I'm not changing the nude lipsticks. I did change my foundation and my primer, my contour and blush, and then my highlighter as well. Everything else is kind of the same. And then I added those two lipsticks instead of the four that I had, I think. And then one red nail polish, one purple, one darkish gold color, and one nude goldish um, monochromatic color, I think you would call it. But, or dichromatic or whatever. But that is it, you guys, for this month's Shop My Stash. Let me know what else you would like to see on this channel, and I will see you in my next one. Peace out.